both by the rising and setting of the sun decreases the duration of life of everyone, except one who utilizes the time by discussing topics of the all person, all good personality of Godhead. Do the trees not live? Do the bellows of the blacksmith not breathe? All around us do the beasts not eat and discharge semen? Men who are like dogs, hogs, camels, and asses praise those men who never listen to the transcendental pastimes of Lord Krishna, the deliverer of all evils. One who has not listened to the messages about the prowess and marvelous acts of the personality of Godhead and has not sung or chanted loudly the worthy songs about the Lord is to be considered to possess ear holes like the holes of a snake or the tongue of a frog. The upper portion of the body, though crowned with a silk turban, is only a heavy burden if not bowed down before the personality of Godhead, who can award mukti, freedom. And the hands that are, de although decorated with glittering bangles, are like those of a dead man, if not engaged in service to the personality of Godhead, Sri Hari. The eyes, which do not look at the symbolic representations of the personality of Godhead, Vishnu, his forms, names, quality, etc., are like those painted on the plumes of a peacock, and the legs, which do not move to the holy places where the Lord is remembered, are considered to be like tree trunks. The person who has not at any time received the dust of the feet of the Lord's pure devotee upon his head is certainly a dead body, and the person who has never experienced the aroma of the tulsi leaves from the lotus feet of the Lord is also a dead body, although breathing. Certainly, that heart, this is the most beautiful verse, this is the one to consider for you. Certainly, that heart is steel-framed, which in spite of one's chanting the holy name of the Lord with concentration, does not change when ecstasy takes place, tears fill the eyes, and the hairs stand on end. Very beautiful string of verses. But I was quoting that at the beginning to uh, put us in context of me every day saying the date and the time, etc., just to appreciate that time is moving along. And we need that urgent connection with the Lord. <laughs>